I put a view that you're not paying your part or your government, your one trick pony as regards carbon tax. I have dozens of individual householders who put on solar panels and in contracts uh, to supply electricity back to, the, back to the grid. I have dozens of farmers that who put up uh, solar panels and I need many who put up uh, miniature um, wind turbines and they can't get into the ESB onto the grid. So you're things just turn in the carbon tax, that's a be all and all, and these people are stacked up waiting, made huge investments, want to do something for the environment, they're not climate change deniers, and they're good people. And they're there now and they can't get onto the grid and the ESP are doing nothing to help them or allow them in. So you're cutting the people all the time. You mentioned intelligence here three or four times in the last couple of days. You haven't a monopoly of intelligence around here at all. Wake up and take it, take away the smoke stream from your eyes and see what's happening with the conglomerates and they're cutting the people and they won't allow people who want to do something, they won't let them do it because they have a monopoly. Yeah, but the, the whole issue around microgeneration was dealt with in the budget and the feeding tariff is due to come in in July um, to help uh, and to once and for all deal with that issue and, to help, and in particular to support July, uh, to support farmers and to support a variety of, of initiatives around microgeneration.